hello guys and welcome back to my youtube channel so uh, if it is your first time to be in this channel consider to subscribe uh, today's tutorial i'm going to show you how to change your photo background uh, without uh, change, without losing the quality of your photo uh, i'll be showing you how to change your photo background without losing any quality so uh, here is the app that we i'm going to use uh, it's called background eraser it is called background eraser this is the application that you can download on play store google play store and it is absolutely free you don't need to pay for it so it is absolutely free and it does amazing work you cannot lose the quality of your photo so um uh, and also i'll be uh i'll be putting the link of this app down in the description so make sure you use the link to download the original the correct the genuine app that i'm talking about remember there are so many background eraser on google play store so you may end up choosing a wrong app but i'll leave a link down in the description so that you can choose the correct app to use now let's load here is where we load our photo let's load the photo uh, let's load the photo from the photos now i'm going to select So let's choose one of the photos. So as you can see, there is a green background behind and we want to uh, to erase that background so uh, first of all we are going to crop as much as possible uh, to remain with a small working area a small working area then we'll make our work so easy so like that then come up here and click done so uh, there are two things that I want to show you guys uh, or rather there are some tools that I want to show you guys uh, so that it is going to make your work easier so first there is this uh, BG color this is a background color you can choose you see the uh, the background is turning to at least darkish so there is th this an uh, auto tool auto tool this is where I if I press in, in this auto tool uh, it means that I'm going to erase uh, the background that I want automatically so how am I going to do it now I just drag uh, this pointer uh, uh, up to the place that I want and uh, release so if I release you see it has erased some small amount now there is threshold of, of similar color adjustment you come and adjust to the percentage you want you see uh, it got uh, to erase even to the parts that I didn't want because the threshold is so high if I reduce uh, it remains somehow little so uh, like you see this is uh, automatic we are using now automatic eraser now this automatic tool makes the work easier much easier so if you are using a background that is of similar color a solid color that means that this automatic tool it is going to select that background and it is going to delete it once So now because the, uh, the, our background is not of similar color, uh, what else am I going to do? I'm going to use a magic tool. A magic tool selects itself the color that you want it to erase. So if I'm going to pass this ma magic tool around the, the background that I want, to, I want it to erase, it is going to erase them automatically. So let's try it. I just passed some, somewhere that I really want. So we are going to try it. Now you see. So you can use your two fingers to pinch out. That means you are zooming your photo. 
like this if you pay, use your fingers to pinch out you are zoom you are zooming so we are going to uh, to use the magic tool to erase the parts that we don't want or rather our backgrounds Now, if you are done, there is also another way you can use to erase your background and it is by using a manual way. Manual way, that means you are going to slowly, slowly, slowly uh, erase the parts that you, you want them uh, erased. So, that is a manual way. Now, when you are done, we are going to, we are going at the right, uh, top, row, uh, at the top right, you are going to, to press done like that. So, here it introduces you to another uh, page. And this is where you are going to f uh, smoothen the edges of your photo. Uh, so, what I, you are going to, uh, you select, like, you, we see here, it is numbered from 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, up to 5. So, that is the amount of smoothness that your edges is going to have. Now, if I'm going to select this tool, you'll notice that it, it, it tries to refine, to smoothen these edges. So, 3, like that, 4, like that. Now, I always like uh, using 4, because uh, if I go to 5, it is going to, uh, to smoothen even to the even it is going to uh, to smoothen the photo that up to the part that I don't want it. So I always like using up to four. So as you see, there, that's where it goes. So I just noticed that there is a small mistake here with my ear, with my ear. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to back. So I'm going to back, and I'm going to do some repair on my ear part. Like this, I'm going to do a repair here. So like that you guys you as you can see my photo is still in the same quality as i uploaded it here so i select the four and save the photo so remember if you have saved the photo it is like this now you are not done so here it asks you to change the background this is where you can choose the other backgrounds that we are given here 
or white background to save as TV. It gives you the background which is white to save in, uh, on it or use as WhatsApp sticker. So since I don't want these options, I'm going to save it the way it is as PNG. Now as PNG. So if I tap here at the top right here, finish, it is going to save my, my photo as PNG. And as you can see, when I zoom out, you will notice that uh, this photo is still in the same quality as it was in the first place. So I'm going to finish. All right. Thank you guys. If you enjoyed this lesson, uh, make sure you subscribe to my channel and like my video and leave a content uh, a comment down there. Uh, to, uh, for more these, uh, for more of this content, make sure you follow me. Make sure you follow me. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. In the next video, I'll be showing you now on how we change that background to a new background. That background that we have changed, uh, uh, we have erased our background. I'm going to show you how to change how to change the background thank you thank you see you in the next video